I am Hiroki Watanabe from Hokkaido University in Japan. Considering the situation of COVID-19 in Japan, we select offline attendance, so we'd like to present by video. The research title is Manipulatable Auditory Perception in Wearable Computing. In this study, we propose a framework to manipulate auditory perception. We assume the user wears a hearable device which is a earphone-type wearable computer. The hearable device captures external sound by the built-in microphone. Then the frequency spectrum is calculated by FFT. We manipulate the frequency spectrum in frequency domain. Finally, the manipulated frequency spectrum is converted to time domain by IFFT. As the manipulation in the frequency domain, Several manipulating techniques are considered. We devised five frequency manipulating techniques compression, overlap, thread, partial illumination, and partial extraction. We show how it works using a sweep signal. The used sweep signal shifts from 0 to 40 kHz in 5 seconds. Without manipulation, we cannot hear the latter half of the sound because it is ultrasound. In compression, the system compresses the sound to the audible range. So we can also hear the sound after 20 kHz. In overlap, the system overlaps ultrasonic range on audible range. We can hear a sweep signal twice. In thread, the system thrives ultrasonic range to audible range, so we can hear only the latter half of the sound. In partial elimination, the system eliminates the part of the sound. In partial extraction, the system extracts the part of the sound. We implemented a prototype. It consists of the earphone, microphone, audio interface, and a tablet. We also implemented Android application. The user can manipulate frequency by this application. We proposed assumed applications that is realized by the proposed method. Note that the developing of a specific application is not the main purpose in this study. The purpose is providing a framework for manipulating auditory perception. However, we introduce assumed applications to show the applicability of the proposed method. Pedestrians are difficult to notice EVs, HVs because of its quietness, especially in the lower speed. However, it is reported that EVs, HVs emit high frequency noise. Proposed method overlaps high frequency sound on audible range sound. We embed multiple voice information in the ultrasonic range. The user can hear only the required information by sliding the corresponding ultrasonic range. XYZ Airlines Flight 123 departing for Honolulu, now ready to check in. Attention passengers, this is the final boarding call for ABC Airlines Flight 6789 to Honolulu. Hammering test is a diagnostic method that uses hammer. This method requires each user to have the necessary experience and skill.
orchestral sound is used for various purposes in public place. Although most people cannot hear that, prolonged exposure to large ultrasound is not good for our health. Due to time constraints, we briefly explain about the evaluation. First, we investigated sound direction conservation after manipulation. The result showed it was sufficient considering the assumed applications. Second, we investigated the delay caused by frequency manipulation at four FFT sites. We confirmed that the smallest FFT size was the best. Third, we investigated the sound quality after frequency manipulation at four FFT sites. The result showed that the largest FFT size was the best. For more details, please refer to our paper. We conclude this study. We proposed a framework for manipulating auditory perception. We devised five frequency manipulating techniques. We investigated sound direction conservation, sound delay, and sound quality after manipulation. Thank you for watching the video.